doctors were killing more soldiers than bullets until one man proved them all wrong with mold. He didn't invent it in a lab. He didn't plan it. He just forgot to clean up and accidentally discovered a drug that saved over 200 million lives. This is the real story of the mold that changed the world. This is the story of Alexander Fleming, the man who turned a chance discovery into a medical revolution, saving millions with a substance we now take for granted, penicillin. Who was Alexander Fleming? Born on August 6, 1881, in the rolling hills of Ayrshire, Scotland, Alexander Fleming grew up on a modest farm surrounded by nature, a world far from the sterile laboratories where his name would one day echo through time. He would go on to become a physician, a bacteriologist, and a silent warrior against infection and disease. After serving in World War I, where he witnessed the horrors of battlefield wounds and rampant infections, Fleming became obsessed with finding a better way to fight bacteria. Then, in 1928, in a moment that seemed almost accidental, Fleming noticed something peculiar, a mold that killed off bacteria in a petri dish. That mold would become known to the world as penicillin. His discovery marked the dawn of the antibiotic era, a breakthrough that would transform medicine and save untold lives. In 1945, he received the Nobel Prize not just for discovering a drug, but for redefining what was possible in modern healthcare. Fleming died in 1955, but his legacy lives on in every healed wound, every cured infection, and every life that was given a second chance.